Welcome to Food Talk with Sharon. We're making a pulao today, an aloo mutter pulao. Now, if you ask me what my favorite vegetable is, I would, without battling an eyelid, say potatoes. So yes, a potato and green peas pulao certainly is a hot favorite for me. You can serve it with just some raita or a side of any curry. It is easy to make. Everything is cooked together in the pressure cooker. So once you put everything in, you just need to pressure cook it and leave it. So let's quickly check out the recipe for this aloo mutter pulao. But before we do that, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. And do click the tiny bell icon and turn on all notifications as well. For making the aloo mutter pulao, into the pressure cooker, add some ghee and first let's add some heeing or esophoetida. In goes some whole spices. I'm adding some cinnamon, bay leaves, star anise, green cardamom, black cardamom and cloves. Let's also add some cumin seeds and fennel seeds and let it all splutter together. To this, add the sliced onions, some ginger garlic paste, a slit green chilli and some salt. Saute this till the onion is translucent. Next, add the chopped tomatoes and cook it for a couple of minutes. To this, let's now add some turmeric powder, chilli powder, coriander powder, garam masala powder and kasuri methi. Saute this till the raw smell of the spices is no longer there and it's really fragrant. Add the cubed potatoes to this and cook it for a couple of minutes. We are anyway pressure cooking it, so we don't need to cook the potatoes at this stage. Let's now add some green peas, coriander leaves and mint leaves and saute it for another minute. Add water to this and let it come to a nice boil. Once the water starts boiling, let's now add the basmati rice and some lemon juice to this and mix it well. I had soaked the rice for about half an hour and have drained off the water before adding it to this. Once it comes to a boil on a high flame, pressure cook this for a single whistle. Let the pressure release naturally and then mix the pulao well and serve it hot. This pulao by itself is quite flavorful and you can just serve it with a side of raita. But if you wish, you can always add in a side dish too. It is a great dish to pack in the tiffin box for kids as well as adults. So I hope you'll try it out.